guys, my name is Ron and welcome to the Noi Fish App. It's Friday today, Fish and Chips Day. Grab your pen and paper, let's start. I've got this lovely fish in here that I prepared a while ago. I'm using a seed ring for my fish and chip. Normally it's called porhana. The next thing we need is this lovely potato, potato. What I did on this one is I blanch it for about 10 to 15 minutes, take it off the heat, strain it, let it chill and rest it for a few minutes. I'm gonna start making the tartar sauce for the fish and chips. Very excited to use this little machine guys. I found this one in Amazon. I decided to buy it because you can use it for chopping or dicing stuff, which is really cool. I got shallots in here. I'm gonna add some cornichons and capers as well. Wait, I'm gonna add wow, a tablespoon of this one. And then some cornishrooms as well. Maybe about know, a few pieces of gherkins in there. I'm gonna add a bit of parsley as well. Put this one on top. The good thing about this one is you don't need to be worried of chopping or cutting your finger because it's safe. Everything is basically inside the machine. And all you need to do is use your finger and pull it. That is really cool. That. Check this out. That is really cool, huh? So this one is done now. What we need to do is add some mayonnaise in it. We're gonna add about three tablespoons of mayonnaise, some touch of lemon. Check this lemon out. It's gigantic. <laughs> I only need a bit of this one. Don't need much. Put some in there. Pepper and a bit of salt and I'm gonna mix it and that's it how easy is that no mess it's safe to use as well I really love it it's good I'm just gonna set this one aside for now leave it in the fridge afterwards we're gonna start making the butter for the fish for the butter I'm gonna drop my flour and baking powder in a bowl then the water I'm gonna add some vinegar in it and whisk it With the other bowl, I'm gonna drop egg white, whisk it till it becomes bubbly or airy. Grab a bit of soap and some pepper as well. Whisk it. And set it aside. Next is the fish. What we need to do on the fish is coat it with some flour in it. Gonna get about two tablespoons of flour. Gonna add a bit of salt as well and some pepper. Mix it using my hand. Drop the fish in. And drop it in my butter mix. We just need to wait for it to become golden brown in color and afterwards we can rest it for a few minutes and drop our potatoes in afterwards. Our fish is now ready guys. We can now take them out of the heat and rest them on a tray with some white roll in it just, just to take that excess oil out of it. That looks really good. With the same pan, I'm gonna cook my potatoes as well. Just be careful when you do this one, guys. It is really hot. Hey guys, thanks all for watching. If you enjoyed watching this video, please don't forget to give me a big thumbs up. Drop me some comments or suggestions down below. 
hit the subscribe and notification button for more videos update. And I'll see you all next time for the next cooking session of the Noi Fisher.